Good evening, fellas. Hope you are all doing well. Today has been a stress. I was in the office in Bristol about two hours ago. I left it just before half five. Um, managed to get home. I've had dinner. The traffic was shite, but we are back in Cardiff. We are back ready for some rebuilding of Red Star. Slayer, Bale, and Credo. Despite your uh, telling me that I'm late, Credo. Yes, I am late. You are correct. I will acknowledge. Um, but yes, very rude nonetheless. Love you, flower. Vaughn, hello, brother. How are we? How are we? How are we? Welcome in. Welcome in. Welcome in. I'm just going to get into it because I am late. Don't panic. I'm late too. Oh, mate. Today has been a nightmare. We are here. We are live. We are live and direct. Champions League is on our mind. Not rude of his true. Valid. Valid. Totally valid. I I agree. If anything, I agree. Um, so this is the current state of play. 11 games played in the league. Nine victories, two draws, zero losses, plus 54 goal difference, 29 points. Champions League, we are joint top uh, with Manchester United, despite having a better goal difference. Uh, and it's 3-3. I don't understand how they're top and we're second. But we've both got four points. Serbian Cup, we are not worried about that one just uh, just yet. Um, tonight, we are talking about putting a dent in some of these games. Now, we're going to have Porto back-to-back -back in the Champions League, uh, which is going to be pretty darn good. Um, and now we progress and we move forward. Um, and this is going to be an absolute dickin' in the league, I would imagine. Right, Serbian Cup first round draw. We take on Zarkovo from the league below. I'm actually very intrigued to see how this uh, these boys get on. Oh, Boris and Bomb is injured. No, not and Bomb. Anyway, talk to me about your days, guys. Credo, how you doing? I saw you message me about. Um, thumbnails and stuff uh i probably will try and get you something in terms of a brief tomorrow mate if that works all right for you i will have a couple bits that i that i need put in together for sure um but that will probably be tomorrow mate at the earliest champions league winner this year mm, like i'm finding it very difficult as you've probably seen i put out my premier league predictions today i'm finding it very difficult to overlook man city i think they have exactly what they needed um yeah i think i think they've kind of added the piece that they needed and i think they're going to be an absolute force this year um man city had a good day back at boxing for the first time in a few weeks and one inspiring nice man i didn't realize there were winners inspiring but either way fair play as I said, it's not something I'd do. Uh, Tyrell, welcome, brother. Are oh, you too late? You've had your window quitting. <laughs> Fair. Emotional, damn it! That's all I'm going to say. Did you use the thing I suggested? Yes, I did. I did. Love getting punched in the face, me. Yeah, it's, 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 not, it's not my vibe, that's for sure. There was just a coach there. Nice, man. Fair play. Yeah, Vaughn, I'm not going to lie. That predictor took me fucking ages. <laughs> it took me an absolute age. Now, there we go. Brueggemann into the penalty area then. Cross comes over far post. Spencer. Oh, it's cleared. Yeah, it took me ages to predict all 38, but we got there. Some people have said that I am I was quite harsh on some of the, some of the uh, teams at the bottom. So, yeah, it's a bit of a mess. How many games have you managed Red Star? Well, this is season number 10, Kiam. So, quite a lot at this point. Um, I don't know for certain. I can probably check after this game, though, if you remind me. Wallop. Ooh. Yeah, no worries, Vaughn. Just a few. Yeah, as I said, this is this is season 10. So, quite we're away in, let's put it that way. Why are we going in slow motion here? What's, what, what the devil's going on? All the way back to Alison Becker. I really wanted to stream this one because I'm not going to be able to stream tomorrow night because of uh, prior commitments. 
Uh, so the network game with Murph will move to Thursday evening. Got the sheet out ready to add to the goals. <laughs> well, it's taken us a long time to do nothing in this particular game, Balin. So I think it's going to be close. I think it's going to be close. Oh, God. What are you tweeting, Credo? On chats. 2034 TNS and Wales manager, you know what I mean? And then there's me who can't hold down a save for a fucking week. I rarely play football manager. I only play football manager when I'm on stream. So I don't know whether it's a case of you lose interest, you lose motivation, you see something else that turns your head. But I've got severe, severe football manager commitment issues. <laughs> that is so true. That is so true. As Ruiz Diaz starts to score him. It's finally happened. It's taken 17 minutes, but we're finally there. Credo, that is true about you, you know. You and Vaughn, save commitment issues. There is a goal. It's happened. Uh, Sebastian Ruiz Diaz has scored. This team aren't very good. I'd expect us to at least score five here. And that was with the old squad, let alone what we've got now. Postaluca! Yeah, I think I need to speak to Sai Maggio about his goal alert, you know. I think I think that's uh, potentially the next uh, next thing we add. Ya lo hace. Pierna derecha directo al arco. Golazo! Golazo! Look at the hit. From them attacking as well. From them attacking as well. Ruiz Diaz just goes, nah, that's far enough. Edge of the area, wallop, top bins. Thank you very much. Goal number two for the games for Sebastian Ruiz Diaz. Well, there's your two, Balin. There's your two. And we're only 26 minutes in. Santa Maria. Looks for the pass into Brueggemann, who's actually not been fantastic thus far as Ruiz Diaz hits the post for what could have been his hat trick sebastian welcome my friend welcome to the chat thank you very much for stopping in hope you're doing well my friend hope you're doing well if it stays that way i'll be happy well you never know we could concede a boatload you know luis diaz then on the ball he's got lots to do here Gives the ball. We've got runners on beyond. Brueggemann then stops his run, but somehow muscles the ball back. Out to Spencer on the left-hand side. Cuts it back to Danica Cisse. Poor cross. That is a dog cross. Postaluka. That's a great turn of pace there. Can he get the delivery in? Back to Brueggemann, who's again not paying attention. But he's managing to tackle the ball. Oh, he's put it in the car park. He's managed to tackle the ball back. It still says I'm not a member. Uh... It does. You're right, Vaughn. And I don't know why that is. Hold on, mate. Let me have a look at my monetization. Look at my memberships. See your members. You're not listed as a member of mine. That's why, mate. I don't know what to say. But yes, you're not listed as a member. I don't know why that is. Maybe the card that's that's uh, setting up has expired or something like that. Maybe. I don't know. I had that with a lot of my stuff the other day. I uh, got myself a new debit card and it's an absolute nightmare. How you doing, Balaam? I'm not worried about that. I'm worried you'll beat my 144. Maybe. Could be. Could be. Uh, it's a good record to break, no? How you doing, Rage? Hope you're doing well, brother. Hung, how you doing? Snap, mine hit the doormat the other day. Yeah, mine's uh, Nat West one. Where is the Serbian link ranked? It is currently ranked 11th in Europe, but that is largely down to every other team in the division being rubbish. Um, I uh, Up until this season, I was the only team to have qualified for a group stage of any European competition. No other team from Serbia had made it to a group stage. So we're in the mud a little bit. And it's 144... Oh, wake up, Alison. It's 144 goals, Vaughn. Throughout the course of a 37-game season, I believe it is. 
Uh, so Balin and I are doing very similar saves. He's obviously picked up the Red Star save because of uh, because of me doing the save. Uh, and he has already finished his season 10. Um, so now has the record in terms of number of goals in a season, which is 144, which is a lot of goals. James, how are you doing, my friend? Good mate, just been on a podcast talking about the villa and finished my Dennis Law remake. Nice, man. What podcast was that that you were on? And yes, the fuck, Alison. Yes, Credo. Yes, it is Alison Becker. A 37 year old Alison Becker. And Ruiz Diaz from the penalty spot. Oh, baby, a triple. Oh, yeah. I swear at the moment, this guy either scores hat tricks or doesn't score at all. Sebastian Ruiz Diaz rounds off a first half hat trick. Good finish from him there. Spencer knackered as well. Oh, no, it wasn't a first half hat trick. It was just after. Rude. Into Hugo Felix. Ooh. Yes, exactly. I got into the Red Star State because you challenged me to see who'd win the Champions League first or do the best by the time FM23 kicks in. Mate, if I've not won it by the time FM23 kicks in, I'm going to be very ashamed of myself. Hugo Felix. Ruiz Diaz for four. Oh, he's missed the goal. That's a bad one. That's a bad one. <laughs> Let's make the change on the left-hand side. Stefanovic comes on for Spencer. Let's make this change as well, if I can touch it there. There we go. Zivkovic comes on. I'll agree with that for sure. Yeah, exactly. Well, are you on a little uh, little break whilst I catch up, Balin? Is that the... Is that the... The... Um, is that the premise that you're on a little, little break from the save until I've caught up a little bit? Because you were two seasons ahead at some point. Every team in the Premier League to talk about last year. Oh, nice, man. Sounds good. Oh, that's the wrong button. Goal! That was liquid football. You goddamn right it was. Hugo Felix getting in on the goals there. 4 0 chat in our return to this save this evening. Ooh, season league records. Most points. I win. Lowest points, I also win. <laughs> Most league wins, we're both on 34. Lowest is also me on 27. League draws, yeah. Yeah. Most league goals scored. Lowest league goals scored 95. That's uh, stinky. Stinky, stinky. Yeah, I like that, Balin. I like it. Yeah, I've not touched Red Star for 13 days as I've completed two seasons for final. Fair play, bro. Smash the like button right now. Uh, exactly, guys. You know, do as Rage says, you know. Check the stats for Red Star. Rough guess is somewhere between 500 and 650 games. Uh, yeah, that would be my profile, wouldn't it? Uh, games games played. Hold on, that's career stats. For Red Star then, because I've done some in international management. 518 matches currently for... Um, 518 matches for Red Star. Uh, which is, is, is pretty good. Yeah, Feyenoord's a good little save. To be fair, uh, Balen, we've got a guy in our office at the moment who's over from Holland. He's a PSV fan. Udinese in Serie A. Strong team to manage. I already can't wait for the for the next game because of the save that we're going to do. Like, it's going to be a nice long save, a nice long progression. Obviously, trying to, trying to oust PSG in France and be another team from Paris at the top is going to be going to be quite interesting. Domingos is scoring at a pretty good rate here, by the way. In the Portuguese league. Which is... Which is above us. I assume they're in sixth. Yeah, they are. 
We are flying up, though. We are flying up. I hear there's going to be Women's League and FM23. I, it's not I'm against it. I just don't want them to rush it. You know? That's where I'm at. I have the bait of saving stone. That's about it. Who are you going for, Credo? I have mine as well, but I might be on holiday. <laughs> Depending. We're talking about going away in November, so... It is the anniversary, so you can't really argue. Fiorentina! Trying to emulate Batty goal, hey? Interesting. Yeah, that's a nice one. Oh, if I'm around, I'll be doing Man City. Beta all day on the beta. Uh, Man City all day on the beta. Yeah, Rage and I have got the same idea. We're going Man City. Ah, oh, Felix is injured. Three to five weeks as well. Playing for bloody... Playing for bloody Croatia. What do you think you've done, Vaughn? Carlos Soto. This guy's going to be looking for game time soon, I'm pretty sure. You'll have to wait and see. Oh, that's going to be a member. That's going to be a membership coming in, chat, I reckon. And you guys can become members as well by hitting the link that's going to be popping up in the chat in a second. There you go. Bayern are so... Uh, all, Bayern are also in a good transition period after losing lower. Oh, mate, yeah, but I looked at the odds today. Bayern are 1-6 to six to win the Bundesliga. Like, mad. Absolute madness. Well, Caesar Falcon. Hello, mate. Unlike you to drop in on the old YouTube. Hope you're doing well, my friend. When's the next El Clasico stream? That is on Thursday. It should have been tomorrow night, uh, but I have a prior commitment that I cannot get out of. And Murph has graciously uh, said that he will move to Thursday evening, Jack. So it'll be on Thursday evening. 38 watching. Jeez. Let's go. Come on, boys. Do as James says. Drop a like on the stream. You know it makes sense. Not too bad. Just got back from work and figured I'd actually pop into one of your streams. Mate, I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Congratulations on your uh, FMTM performance the other night as well, my friend. I may have to pick your brain about what Fox in the Box played for the playoffs coming up. And good work behind the scenes as well on the playoffs as well, I have to say. There it is. You didn't even give me a message, Vaughn. <laughs> it would have read it out for you. I'm waiting for my noise to kick in because I've seen it already. I'm waiting for my actual alert. To... Oh, yeah. There you go. There it is. Atlas TV, otherwise Vaughn. Atlas TV. There you go. That's all it read out is now a member to the channel again with that professional membership. My brother. Ako, welcome, my friend. Yeah, new member. I know, right? Hold on. Let me let me check something. Let me check. It should say in my monetization, it should say rejoined. Yeah, so it says here. Oh, Christ, you sent me a long list of stuff. Says here, Vaughn, that you've rejoined, so don't worry. It, it, it has said new member, but that's only because that's what the text says when someone becomes a new member. You know? That's trophies on that Discord message. One, two, three, four. You want to win five Serie A's? That's a long save, bro. I don't know if you got the attention span for that. Vojvodina up next. Foxy did that three up top, but with a striker on the right wing against me. Didn't serve him too well. But, mate, honestly, Maltese, Falcon, anything you're playing right now is... Uh, anybody you play right now is getting sliced and diced, honestly. It's a nightmare. No, I didn't see that, Credo. What's happened with Alpine? 
<laughs> you have a good point with the attention spam thing. It's one of those things, man. It's one of those things. Right, Vojvodina. One of the bigger teams in Serbia, actually. And the main man is back in. Nice car. He's had a little break, and he's back. Abdullah Kokoman. The lethal force it is up top. Pablo Torre actually getting some game time at, at Cam. This is going to be quite interesting because obviously Hugo Felix is injured. Got injured on international duty away at Portugal. I'm just too good. Ignore the fact he went down. Oh, I didn't see that. I only saw the table, mate. So I saw you come top. So it's all good. <laughs> That's the main thing. You've, it, where did you... Where, 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 where are you in size FM rankings? You've got to be flying up there now. Absolutely flying up there. Where's the image, Simon? Plates, McTyler, Lelujo. Twenty first. You're having me on shambles. That's a shambles. Absolute shambles. It's a video. Right, let's have a look and see what Credo sent. Uh, go to the site. Oh, shit. Nice car. Oh, man. They put out... Oh, no, 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 no. That's a bad look, man. That's a bad look. Oh, well. Is what it is. Oh, sorry. When you said it's a video, I thought you meant the... um. I thought you meant the, the post that you'd sent about Alpine. Sorry. My bad. I miss Valencia. Do a Valencia save. Maxi Gomez, pretty good. I'm a big fan of Maxi Gomez in a draft. The cock. He's not going to score from out there. But he is. Goal! That was liquid football! You plonker Rodney. Yeah, I know. Sorry. I know, I'm sorry. Just got back from the Hungarian Grand Prix. Have I missed something? I thought Grand Prix were at the weekend. Or is it like testing or something that you've been to, Scott? How was it either way? This guy's in no hurry here. Absolutely negative hurry. Great pass. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, that was where it was at the weekend. Oh, nice, man. Shows how much I know about uh, FM, doesn't it? Goal! That was liquid football! Well done, Mr. Spencer. The only one of our attacking players actually having a poor game. I'm still quite baffled as to how he's brought this down. And slotted. Flew back from Budapest last night. Mate, Budapest is sick. I went there on a stag do. It was really good. Do you need to go to bed? Yes. Yes, I do. Thank you. <laughs> yes, most certainly, Credo. I, I definitely do need to go to bed. Starting to get a bit of a headache as well, but we're, we're, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. <laughs> Ooh, Cockerman misses. What league should I load? It's England, Spain, Italy, Germany, France, Scotland that I need to win. Shall I add some more or is it already too long? What I do, Vaughn, is I go into the advanced setup. Hold on, hold the line caller. Nice car. Um, I go into the advanced tab and I add players from top clubs from South America and Europe is what I would suggest. I love this button. Yeah, I do that too. Yeah, that's the way to do it. How powerful is your computer, basically? Also that. Um, but yeah, like, as as Mal's saying, like, it all depends on your computer. Like, I am obviously not going to go for the most ludicrous setup because I'm streaming as well. So, like, I don't want to chug the computer down when I'm trying to load through, like, transfer windows and shit like that. So, 
Villa in ninth next year. I can't remember off the top of my head where I said I put them. Hold on. Hold the line, caller. Oh, I had them in 15th. Yikes. Big, big yikes. But adding players is always a good idea. It doesn't actually affect the speed despite what the game says. Yeah. It's more the processing power. It's not the speed for me. 85k players on two star. Yeah, don't worry about it. It's, it's much the same as looking at players, bro. I never consider the star rating. My game speed is probably set at one star. My game speed is probably like half a star, one star, I think, on this. So I won't worry about it too much, Vaughn. As the third best team in Serbia, Vojvodina are not really, not really giving anything here. Loading in Spain, England, France, Germany, Italy, Scotland. Nah, I think you'll be fine. That was a nice finish. Goal! That was liquid football! How could you pick Villa in 15th? I thought we were mates. Someone's got to finish 15th, mate. Someone's got to finish 15th. Um, yeah, I just thought other teams would do well. I, I My dark horse is Leeds. I think Leeds are going to be good. Where did I put Newcastle? It's it's posted in Discord, Vaughn. Um, I had Newcastle in 10th, everybody. I think United will be okay. I, I put them as 5th, though. Like, I, think, I think Newcastle will win some games, lose some games, finish around the same sort of position. That's kind of where I got them. Oh, is that a second yellow for Topic? It is. Bam, 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 bam. Never from there, Spencer. Oh, Christ, almost. He went for a bit of a knuckleball there, you know. Arsenal looking exciting. I agree. I don't think so, Rage. I don't think so. I've got Bournemouth gonna. <sighs> oh. Goal! That was liquid football. I think Bournemouth. My bottom three was Bournemouth, Fulham, Brentford. It was my bottom three. I think Nunez will outscore Haaland this season. Hung, I will bet you some good money on that if you want. I will take that bet from anybody. Haaland's a machine. Full and Brentford leads. I can see that. I disagree Goal! about leads, but. That was liquid football. Nice car. Oh, baby, a triple. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Balen, I had your team to finish top or finish higher. I think Fulham might stay up this year, but then again, I thought that every time Fulham had been promoted. Nah, oh, man, honestly, honestly. It's crazy. It's it's crazy. Like full of this like Fulham Norwich. I don't know. Just can't stay there. Doing a UFC four career as well, been given a championship fight in the light heavyweight division against John Jones. Nice. There's a lot of hype around Paddy the Baddy, which I'm enjoying at the moment. I think he's good value. YouTuber as well. Strike. Ericsson will get injured next season because he will start more than Bruno. I don't think so. From where do you got the scoreboard? What? What? I, I'm a little bit confused. What do you mean, my friend, about the scoreboard? Easy six points. <laughs> yeah, like I, I said in the video that went out today, I was like, I was very impressed with, um, very impressed with the business that Forrest have done. I'm probably a bit harder on you guys, Rage, because I hate Coutinho. <laughs> that could have something to do with it. I'm not going to lie. That could have something to do with it.
All right, couple days rest, and then we take on Porto away in the Champions League. This is a big one, this, actually. Uh, so that is a two-game week, as is that one. Sweet. And to be honest, Vaughan, I think Sunderland are going to beat Bristol City at the weekend. Oh. Yawny. Unfortunately for you, Steve, I agree. Mate, we were so, so bad on Saturday. Say 2 1 Sunderland. Like, Vyman scored again for Bristol City. And I, I, I said to my neighbor, who's a Cardiff fan, I was like, I'd be very surprised if. Uh, I'll be very surprised if um, if that happens. Rage, that's ludic That's a ludicrous bet from you. I don't have 500 quid that I could lose, to be honest. So, <laughs> just by just by sheer volume of bet, I can't. I couldn't do that. If you lowered the stakes, I'd have a punt on Forest fi uh, finishing above Villa. That's what I was thinking, Balen. That's what I was thinking. What skin is this? This is the Vince skin, my friend. Harry, there will be a link popping up in the chat in just a second where you can download this skin. But it is the best skin out there, if you ask me, the Vince skin. I said pick off, pick up where you left off last time after absolutely annihilate. Why are we both playing in blue? Our home kit is red and white. <laughs> Why are we playing in blue? Our, our third kit is all white as well, so like... Shambles. Shambles, shambles, shambles. They don't have our guy playing up top, do they? Luis Diaz as well. Who's that? Has he got... Has he gone back to Porto? Go on, Spencer. Put the pressure on. João Mario. Oh, Maxi Gomez scores headers for me. Oh. He would have been, but I'm I'm surprised he wouldn't have left is, is more my question. Pablo Torre in on goal, maybe. Cuts it back to Spencer. Cissé. Oh, the cocks missed. Yeah, I'm just surprised he wouldn't have left. I'll check at halftime. Well, I hate to say this has been one-way traffic again, chat, but it kind of has, hasn't it? How's the new look squad doing, mate? We are pretty darn good, man. We drew 3-3 with Manchester United in the Champions League last night. We should have won that game. Absolutely annihilated them. We're having so many nice spells. Put the ball in the back of the net. Hood, do you think it would be better to live stream FM23 or just do videos? Personally, I think it's a good combination to do both. I will be doing both. You'll make me a wager. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm intrigued to see what's coming here now. That Teller's Magno as well. Villa in the top eight. See, the thing is, right... Oh, fuck, it is Luis Diaz. See, the thing is, right, I, I cannot bet £500. 
I refuse. I will not do it. I don't have 500 quid to lose, so I'm not going to do it. United are four up against St. Gallen as well. If I win, you have to wear a Villa shirt for a month's worth of streams. Oh, we scored. If you win, I'll donate £500 to your channel. Mad. I'd wear a Villa shirt for a month. I'll take that. So, if Villa finish inside the top eight, I've got to wear a Villa shirt for a month. And if, you, if I win and they don't finish in the top eight, you'll donate... Yeah, fuck it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's screenshot that bad boy. I'll have to get the Villa shirt on the wash every... Uh... I have to get the uh, Villa shirt on the wash after every fucking stream because I get really hot in here. Luis Diaz. He's fucking scored again, you know. Luis Diaz absolutely shredded me. Does the Villa shirt have to have Coutinho on the back? Oh, mate, I do hate Coutinho. I think he's a waste of money. I think he's a waste of space. How many goals will Haaland score this season? In all comps, I think he'll do over 30. Comfortably. Top eight. Eight's, eight's high, though, man. Eight is really high. So I man, I went Man City, Liverpool, Spurs, Chelsea, United, Arsenal. That's high, man. Oh, Mao, you didn't need to do that, brother. Thank you very much, man. Enjoy your network game. Also take some of this in lieu of a Twitch sub. Yeah. Art. Too kind, man. Thank you very much. I appreciate that, Mal. It's for all the trauma, trauma you've given me with some of the beatings in the PvP, right? Stevie G, hello, my friend. I think with it being Newcastle's first season with new owners, the pressure and focus will be mainly on them. Uh, maybe. Let's go. Go! That was liquid football! I'm going to keep the morale high. We are away in the Champions League, so... I'm not totally against the Desmond. Nah, Ross, we've moved on. We've moved on. He did score the equaliser in the... in the. Oh, he's just scored again for Manchester United. He did score the equaliser in our 3-3 draw with Manchester United uh, last night. So that was quite irritating. But um, other than that, no, I'm not missing... I'm not missing Luka Kana. It was the right time. The money was right. It was... It, the money was right. It allowed me to facilitate the rest of the squad at a right time as well in terms of us going into the EU and all that stuff. So, it felt right. It felt right. He's a good player, though. Don't get me wrong. He is a good player. Uh, and, I mean, he scored again there. Or he scored, and they've got six in their game. And he scored a hat-trick. Oh, baby, a triple! Oh, yeah! He's not our player, but he is my player, isn't he? You know what I mean? He plays for United, but he's still my boy. Regardless, it was the right time to move on, on move on with him. But uh, yeah, Kana will always will always be my boy. We're being super sloppy in possession, I must admit. Good interception there, Pablo Torre, Bjorkovic, Berg, Cockerman. 
Uh, has the runs beyond and then just gets caught again. Ball over the top. This is a problem. Tell us Magno. He's in. <sighs> For fuck's sake, man. Ah. Uh... I really thought this was the year, chat, you know? Woohoo! The cock cocked it up. He certainly did. Ryan, welcome in, my friend. Thank you very much for the new subscription. I do appreciate it. Welcome to the channel. Go on, go on, cock. This is your chance, bro. You are easy clear here. Oh, he scores so he's in his sleep chat as well. Oh. Another game. Oh, so irritating. Another game where we've dominated the opposition in the Champions League. And we've not got the three points we deserve. As United win 8-0. I am fuming. Yeah, no worries, Vaughn. See you in a bit, brother. Why are all my players tired? My whole squad, man. Absolutely knackered. Oh, so irritating, man. So irritating losing games that you really deserve to win. Deserve to beat both them and Manchester United. We should easily be top of our Champions League group, but fuck me. I know that was the away game, and I know we can make that up in the home game, but man, that's annoying. So we've got this one. Okay, then we got another league match beforehand. Okay. Okay. Hmm, okay. We can get things back on track with a league match here. Ah, oh, quick pick, rotated, more rotation. Let's go. Luka Sushik, he's not very good in this particular instance, Stevie, unfortunately. CT, hello, my friend. Welcome, good sir. Welcome, welcome. 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 All right, come then, lads. But let's bounce back against it after this disappointing, uh, disappointing result against Porto. Definitely did not deserve to lose against Porto. What a taunt and town tweet in Credo. Taunt and tan. Ah, uh, fair play. Go! That was liquid football. That's clever from Taunton, to be fair to him. I like it. Santa Maria. And Stefanovic is there at the far post to slot home again. It's like at the moment we've got a league side and a Champions League side. The Champions League side. Oh. Go! Football. It's like we've got a league side and a Champions League side. The league side are doing their bit for the most part, you know. Um, obviously, we dropped some points against Partizan. Um, where we gave away a penalty and they scored their only shot on target. I'm finding that a lot in the match engine at the moment. Finding that a lot. United scored with not many, um, not many shots on target. Porto did the same in that game. 
Uh, Partizan did the same in their game. The team that we drew against did the same in that game. Christ. They almost did the same there. Got Mackies for lunch at like 1 p.m. You need to try the loot, the new halloumi fries. Oh, mate, I'm a big fan of a halloumi fry, I must admit. We're going to have a penalty. Balon, I think you're going to need to... Uh, I think you're going to need to get your goal chart out, right, buddy, because we are... We are humping teams in the league. Love a bit of salty cheese. Creo, who doesn't, bro? Who doesn't? How are you feeling today anyway, man? Are you still feeling a bit knackered or... Has it caught up to you yet? Kike is taking it. Okay. And he sees it saved. That could, that could easily be another pen. No, Ross. I've never played any of the UFC games, actually. Never played any of the UFC games. I've not played a fighting game since SmackDown vs. Raw ages ago. Like back when I was in secondary school, I've not played uh, not played a, a, a fighting game, if you can call WWE that. Goal! That was liquid football. Okay, well that's not awful then, Credo. To be honest, the fatigue is what I struggle with the most. Intense flu-like symptoms. Yeah, I see what you're saying. Def Jam Vendetta was class. <laughs> yeah, man. Like I've not played a I've not played a fighting game for ages, to be honest. Cough is settling. Yeah, I didn't have one. Did not have a cough. Didn't have a cough, which is which you know is 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 crazy if you ask me. Samazic with the corner. Bojan heads over. Def Jam Vendetta. What a game, man. We are already 12 points clear of Partizan. They're not the team in second right now, but they will be come the end of the season. I'm pretty confident. I'm gonna say I'm happy with the way things are. We also need to keep an eye on Partizan in terms of that. Oh, for fuck's sake, why is it keeps doing this? Thank you, mate. Hiya. Cheers, Greedo. It felt really warm last night, 2 a.m. My bedroom was 23 Celsius and 88% humidity. Fuck, that's sticky, bro. Look, Chris, mate, I uh, I like the Elgato. It's, uh, it's good, man. The Elgato webcam is very nice. Imagine Def Jam nowadays. It would be like H versus Stormzy or something. Yeah, exactly. And I know, I know who's winning that fight. Fuck me. 100% <laughs> back in Big Mike there. How could you imagine? Like with all the all the like YouTuber boxing sort of vibe. If it was just like H versus Stormzy, could you imagine? I have to admit, I'm fascinated by the whole YouTuber boxing sort of sort of thing. Like all the drama around it. Like anyone who is. Anyone who is able to sell a fight, I know they're good at marketing, you know? <laughs> Hi, Grayson. How you doing, boy? Hope you're doing well. That's a great pass from uh, uh, Allison. Obviously, that is something that Allison does offer. Ruiz Diaz. Goal! That was liquid football. 
Hey, John, what have you missed? Um, in the league, obviously been pretty rampant. Annoyingly, we lost to Porto in a game that we should have won in the Champions League. But other than that, man, you've not missed a huge abundance. How are you doing anyway, John? Win that ball. Good save, Allison. Good save, Allison. You cheeky pucker is his fave words. <laughs> oh man, you're you're in for uh you're in for a tough time there, Balam. Jay pulls a tip that is actually he's actually a semi decent boxer. I agree. Very very good marketer as well. I have to admit. I think the stuff he's doing for women's boxing again is 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 actually quite impressive with Amanda Serrano. So, the new undisputed UFC light heavyweight champion of the world, Vaughn Davis, is back. <laughs> GG's Vaughn. How'd the fight go? I was going to say, Vaughn, Ross has uh, said he, he's just started playing UFC 4 as well. As I said, big, big Paddy the Baddy fan. In the old UFC. First round was decent, second round. Uh, Vaughn, Ross. Yeah, Ross. Already learned shit and fun. Oh, dear. Uh, it, mate, honestly, that would be the same in my house if, if we were to have kids. It would be the exact same. Louise and I swear like sailors as well. So, it is what it is, isn't it? Yeah, Paddy the Baddy. Big fan. He's going to be the next, like, McGregor-esque, like, star in the UFC. Like, being able to sell fights and, and stuff like that. I think he's going to be a, a big-time talent, big-time draw. Let's see who's trying to take my belt. <laughs> I assume you can do, like, the old, like, career mode-esque thing. That's what you're doing, right, Vaughn? I'm going to fully rotate the team for this cup match and instant result it, just as an FYI. That's what you're doing? I thought as much. Rotated squad, full rotation. Venom is going to get his game. Instant result, yes. I was bad with language, but Sarah is a pit miner's daughter, granddaughter, and niece, so she's far worse than me. <laughs> well, fair play. We get a 5-1 victory in the Serbian Cup, which is quite nice. Fitness concerns for Cuevas, but Santa Maria gets two assists. Would you try Stefanovic up front? Um, No. Uh, the pecking order is Kokoman and Ruiz Diaz. And then Stefanovic. Stefanovic is scoring a decent amount off that left-hand side, though. Coming in and actually heading the ball. Being six foot four, like, that's actually quite good. Gustafsson. Nice. That's a tough fight. That would be a tough fight. He's a good, uh, good light heavyweight. But if you've knocked out John Jones, then... How long have I got? Three days rest. Let's give him two days rest. Drogba. He could be a little bit. It's, I've just seen it's official Lorenzo Lucas signed for Ajax. Fuck. Mad. Football. Mate, honestly, why would you scout anywhere? Like, if you, like, genuine question, right? If you're a championship... Not championship. Championship's probably a little bit too far. Probably a little bit more professional. But if you were like... um, If you were like... A League 2 club. Why would you not use Football Manager, you know? I'd 100% use FM for scouting. Ha <laughs> ha! 
you can actually do uh actually type messages out that's sick i like that i write that Clubs definitely do. They just don't admit it. Well, exactly, Stick. Hello, mate, by the way. Um, clubs definitely do. I completely agree with you. Especially in the fact that, you know, when they did the um, All or Nothing Tottenham stuff, they showed Jose's uh, desktop. And, obviously, uh, like, it, it as part of that. And he obviously had FM22 there. So, you know, why wouldn't they? Also, pretty sure SI shares their attributes with scouting networks. What, like Y Scout and stuff like that? Y Scout's the one that they use in the UK at the very least. No worries, Vaughn, no worries. Hoffenheim use FM22, that's how they bought Firmino. Exactly, man, exactly. But this is what I'm saying, like lower down clubs and stuff. I don't know why you wouldn't. <laughs> Go! Cheeky corner goal to get us started in this one. Stick, how did the rest of Merce draft finish yesterday, by the way? Unfortunately, I had to dip out before our game. I think there's going to be an Arsenal dock on Prime. Yes, all or nothing Arsenal. It was uh, a film last season, wasn't it? I find players going through Wikipedia's national teams. Exactly. There's all sorts that you can do, but it's like the time constraints to do it, you know. Like, football coaches aren't going to go and do that. And it depends if you've got the scouting network that are young enough to think of something like FM. Goal! That was liquid football! I demolished your AI stick. Yeah, you should do, man. You should do. You should demolish my AI. Ah, but since you didn't go on holiday, I didn't get to test again. Yeah, I had to I had to leave leave and then get ready for stream. So yeah, unfortunately not. If you weren't Alice's assistant manager, I'd send you the latest version of my tactic. I'm doing a Bundesliga Network Savers Alsberg, and I've got Ryan Graben, Birch, and Fabio Silva on loan. Fair play. <laughs> That's a good good set of youngsters there, CT. Yeah, that is going well, I bet. Even when you leave, leave, you can go on holiday. I did not know that, Stick. See, see, this is all stuff that's new to me, you know? I'm going to try and participate in a few more of Murph's, uh, Murph's drafts. But obviously, once we know the stipulation for uh, for the playoffs, I don't know how uh, generous we're going to be with each other, you know? Goal! That was liquid football! I've seen lately that advertising it as a rebuild series now. Are they actually? Oh my god, that'd be amazing. That'd be amazing if they did do that, Credo. Looking for young players with a lot of caps at a young age? Yeah, that's a good way to do it. Again, but Maybury, that information is available in Football Manager. It's just basically just a glorified spreadsheet, isn't it? I'm going to hit this now. I think we're scoring this. Sometimes it may be good, sometimes it may be shit. That's the wrong button, but that works, doesn't it? <laughs> that's the wrong button for sure, but it definitely works. Well, she already has my three striker answer tactic and I can't help her more with it once the stick comes out because I'm on comms. Ooh, yes, of course you are, stick. Of course you are. Hmm, interesting. How are the dogs? Yeah, dogs are really good, man. Dogs are, dogs are really, really good. Thanks for asking, Ross. I have seen the words rebuild thrown around a lot. I wonder who throws that around, hey? I wonder if uh, there's going to be some complaints about it. At Amazon. Pablo <laughs> Torre scores from the spot. Stick, if, if you gave Alice a three striker tactic, why didn't she use it against me? She even said that in the in the draft. I remember her saying, like, if anyone's going to use three strikers against me, then that's a problem. <laughs> Goal! That was liquid football! Balen, get your spreadsheet out, man. We're battering them. She forgot. Ah... Uh... It's not like you don't know what I'm going to play, to be fair. 
That's why I call my new series, new series Totally Rebuilt. That T just to keep you out of trouble. Yeah, exactly, Stick. Exactly. Ah, it's all good, man. It's, it, like, it's a word at the end of the day. It's in the English language. It's like, it's the same with tactics, right? There's only so many combinations you can do in Football Manager, you know? Um, it's just one of those things. Barcelona rebuild but they don't rebuild they just keep getting more debt uh Ross if you want to do if you want to see a version of that please do check into the network game with Murph FM because that's basically what he's doing he is spiraling those bad boys into more debt whilst I'm trying to be a little bit more sustainable Haxi welcome as a new subscriber to the channel thank you thank you thank you Right, 7-0 at half time, hey? Who'd have thought? Came for the cock, stay for the manager. Murph, no way you've just arrived as I've said that and slagged you off. No way. <laughs> no way you've just arrived as I've said that. <laughs> Did you hear me slag you off? I hope you did. Sad. <laughs> oh, man. Good pass. Ruiz Diaz. Goal! That was liquid football. He's been here the whole time. Stick, I, I, I definitely... It's nothing I wouldn't say to his face. <laughs> it's nothing I wouldn't say to his face. Uh, we're winning 8-0. Did I see that Paolo uh, Torre's got a hat-trick? Did I see that correctly? If... If... He has, then I, I'm owed a Oh Baby a triple button. Oh my god. Goal! That was liquid football! Stefanovic has got at least two, I know that for certain. Right, let's, let's have a... Let, oh my god. These highlights are absolutely relentless. Yeah, let's let's replace 99. Nah, I missed it. You're lucky. Do you want me to repeat what I said, Murph? I'll happily say it again. <laughs> Especially now you're starting to Photoshop me pointing at things because of my thumbnail. Torre. Ooh. So effectively, Murph, um, we had Ross mention earlier, we were talking about rebuilds and stuff, right? And he said, Barcelona rebuild where they don't rebuild, they just keep getting in more debt. And I basically said, he needs to tune into our network save because that is effectively what you're doing to the club. <laughs> you are putting them in fur further and further into debt. So that's basically what I said, Murph. I've made eight already. Eight? Oh, fucking hell. Goal! That was liquid football! Can I have some tips on how to get better, J2? What 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 do you want to know, man? What do you want to know? World is your oyster. Ask away, my friend. Ya lo hace. Pierna derecha, directo al arco. Golazo! Golazo! So close. <laughs> I'm doing a real life rebuild, just keep adding the debt. Yes. <laughs> Valid. <laughs> Very true to uh, real life, that, isn't it? Uh, Hugo Felix is just coming back from injury. We're not going to risk him in a game that we're 10 0 up in. You're fighting Gustafsson again for the belt, fair. I was going to say, J2, there's plenty of people in here who know their football manager who'd be willing to help. Rome's unhappy with you. It's his birthday. Can you make a photo of me pointing to a, a cake or something? It's like... I fucking hate posing for stuff. I hate it. I hate it. Exactly. As I said, there's, there's seasoned football manager players in here. That can... Uh, they can answer any questions you got, J2. And if that's a photo of Pingu as your avatar, I am well happy. He's gutted on, oh, mate. 
Good save, Allison. Good save. Noot, noot. Exactly, Credo, exactly. Louise is going to message me and be like, why are you, why are you newt newting? Right, so, Paolo Torre scored a hat-trick, so you're owed a button. Oh, baby, a triple! Oh, yeah! I think the debt situation in Spain is irrelevant. Real Madrid is viewed as a cultural diplomacy for the state, and I believe the government funds are being put into the club. Maybe some, maybe the same for Barcelona. It definitely is the same for Madrid. Yeah, that is true. What do we think of Tottenham? <laughs> What do we think of Tottenham? Shit! What do we think of shit? Tottenham! Thank you. Defo changed the sub noise to Newt Newt. We could do. Good youngsters and who to sign if you're on a low budget. Go on then, boys. Help him out. I mean, I do have a filter, a video about a filter that you can use to find good young players. Hashtag ad. How many league goals are you on now? I missed the last two games. <laughs> uh, so, Balen, we are now on 86 goals for out of 15 games. Is that it? Don't tell me he's retired in this. Oh, no. You spelt his name wrong, Murph. There he is, Ricky the Pig. <laughs> Ricky the Pig. Barca sold future TV profits for a cut rate for money now. Yeah, exactly. I, I swear I heard that they've, um, they're have um they selling like land assets as well, as in like, not not like the training ground, but stuff like that. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, they're just kick it, kicking the can down the road, which I think is going to bite them in the backside. Like, they need success pretty darn quickly. Production studio, yeah. <laughs> Bar that, is that why they announced Lewandowski with some, some intern on his phone just at the beach? Just like, go on, Robert. Do what you need to do, pal. Shambles. Radniki O. I don't even know who they are. They're not even in the division below us. It's crazy what Barca are doing, to be perfectly honest with you, but is what it is. Sky Portugal for young players that are cheap. Yeah, Portugal, Colombia, and Peru would be my suggestions. But if you're working lower down the budget, lower down the budget. If you're working lower down the league system and you're looking for players, get your scouts looking for end of contract players. That would be my suggestion. If you're like, you know, League 1, League 2 level or like the third or fourth tier of whatever country you're managing in, that would be my suggestion. Right, we need to make this vi uh, game against Porto count here, chat. We need to win this, otherwise we're going to get battered. And we're going to go into the Europa League with our best squad ever. Syria, also a good shout for Maybury. Hermes, hello my friend. How are you? I am golden. Took a little bit of time to get back here and uh, and, and rush and get on online on time. But we're here. We've made it. Sign Marcelo. Play him as a regista. Not everyone's you, Murph. I think they're at least making good signings, though. I think they'll do pretty well this year. Yeah, I agree. It's definitely better than some of the, some of the summer windows they've had previously. Um, yeah, I, I, I like some of the signings that they're doing. Although, I, I swear I heard something today uh, from a guy in the office who's, who's Dutch. So, obviously, is kind of clued in an, a little bit with um, the Frankie de Jong situation. Um, I believe they've got to pay him some money, not for his contract. Because I know he deferred his contract. But if they, if they don't pay him the money, then they may not be able to register Lewandowski or something to that effect. Is what I heard. Cockerman's in. Oh, outside of the post for Cockerman. The Syrian players are so determined they can become amazing. They largely have a minimum of 16 determination. Yeah, also a good thing to look for. 
I hope you showed everyone the new advert. I haven't, no. I have told people, Murph, but I've not showed them the visuals that you've created. I could do the Giroud pointing at a bum one as well, if you want. <laughs> oh dear. Flying hook. Not good. Good touch, Spencer. Again, it looks like we're all over Porto. Ya lo hace. Pierna derecha, directo al arco. Golazo! Golazo! Wow! Golazo! Pablo Torre. What a, what a goal that is. No worries, J2. Any, any other questions you got, man? Just as I said, chuck them in. Big room is De Jong going to Chelsea for money plus Alonso and Aspi. Probably a good trade all, all, all around. I think Lewandowski was probably their worst signing, but I get why they did it. He's not going to win them the Champions League, so at that point they should save the wage budget. You say he's not going to win them the Champions League, but... I don't know. He's going to make La Liga a lot easier for them. Oh, he's done it again, chat. Goal! That was liquid football. All good, Credo, all good. I'm most spamming those GYRFM heads in the chat. I'll do the same. It's his tactic, to be fair. Lewandowski is set to be registered in the league. Barcelona activated their third level leveler. The sale of 10% of Barca Studios for 100 million. It's crazy. It's crazy what they're doing, Barcelona. Also chucked in some Hala Madrid. Um, so I will show you guys what Murph has done. Hold the lines, caller. Oh, Murph renewing his membership whilst he's here. For the old three months. So in case you missed it, we will not be streaming tomorrow. And this is, uh, yeah, picking work over FM. We've had to move this week's El Clasico network game to Thursday at 7 p.m. instead. My Barcelona currently sit top of the table. Let's not bottle it again. See you all Thursday at 7 p.m. Taking the photo of me pointing at something from today's thumbnail and put it on pointing at his Barcelona team at the top of the league. That, everyone is a pain <laughs> i like his creativity though with the signings they made top two in la liga was probably guaranteed but again yeah exactly i think lewandowski will be better than memphis yeah i can see that i can see that i genuinely think barcelona will be pretty good this year um all around I think I think I think Barca will do well in real life. Not with not if Murph's their manager though. Cockerman's in. Oh, nice car. Nice car. As soon as I saw the thumbnail, I had to cut that image out for my own personal use. Yeah, exactly. For me, the best signing is Dembele. He's a beast. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. United have uh, conceded a goal against St. Gallen. Couldn't be me, chat. Could not be me. Oh, Vasilek's playing for Man City as well. Love it. Is that Billy Gilmore? What is going on? Zarabiani, fair play. Kunde's a beast. Yeah, Kunde's a fantastic signing. Chelsea should have really, should have really got him. Yeah, they, yeah, Ruben, Ruben's right. Kunde is also a beast. Is he onside here for the set piece? He ran away with his arms down, so I assume the answer is no. How many subs have we made? Zivkovic has come on. Felix needs to come off. He's absolutely knacked. The former Benfica man, obviously. Obviously trying to play his high against Porto. Uh, so let's make some changes here. A swap Spencer for Stefanovic. Let's take off Hugo Felix and bring on 
Samazic. Let's, let's actually, you know what? Let's, let's change. Oh, I can't change all of them. I was going to say let's change all three of the guys behind uh, behind the cock. But um, unfortunately, we're only able to change two of them because we've already made a change at centre back. Only short, sure, as you know, the drill. Up soon for work. Oh, no worries, man. Take care, Murph. Take care, man. How many caps has Hugo Felix got for Portugal? He just got injured on Portugal duty in a game against Poland. So I will have a look in a sec. Good night, cock. Nice cock. Oh, that was good timing. Nice cock. <laughs> the cockerman has scored again. Sorry I'm late, just got back from football. Martin, never a problem, my friend. Hope football went okay. Was it just training or was it a match? Was watching the Prem prediction, it kicked me in. Ah, see, that's don't you love YouTube doing YouTube things? Thanks, Stick. I appreciate it, man. Take care. Don't you love YouTube doing YouTube things? Twitch doesn't do that for you. Just training. Nice, man. Gotta be. Oh, you're left footed, man. Why didn't you just shape it? Shape it. Give it a little shape. Oh. <laughs> Goal! That was liquid football! I think this is us kind of atoning for the narrow defeat last time the 3-2 defeat this is us putting our stamp on the fact that we are better than porto personally i think we are better than manchester united tory is basically a replica of skulls he's doing really well at the moment Cockerman could be in for a hat-trick here. Obviously, we are gunning for him to be the top goal scorer in the Champions League ever. Uh, a record which currently Luka Karna does hold. Cross comes over. Ooh, Stefanovic was looking, though. He was lurking. Lurking at the far post like a Dean Gherkin. Cockerman. Ooh. Casual hit. Goes wide. Understandably so. Manchester United have got a plus 15 goal difference. However, they have played St. Gallen twice. Cross to the far post. Heads back. The cock. Nice cock. And I believe. Oh, baby, a triple. Oh, yeah. Oh, baby, a triple. Samarzic, lovely take on the chest there. Gets it out. Abdullah Kokoman scores another hat-trick in the Champions League. 9.8. Played a season with Benfica and Darwin Nunes got 60 goals. Fair play. That's not a bad return. Not a bad return. Right. Kokoman. Champions League overall. Currently sat at 16. The record is 19. And we've still got two group games to go. One of which is against St. Gallen. The furthest you've been with the Serbian team in the Champions League. We got to the Champions League semi-finals a couple seasons ago. Woohoo! Woohoo! Welcome as the Dino, as a new subscriber to the channel. How does your editor get old videos from your YouTube to edit with? Um, what do you mean, CT? Like, some streams... After, for the for the past couple of weeks, I've been recording whilst I've been um, I've been recording the stream whilst I've been streaming. So that's how he's got it this time around. So he's only got six caps, Maybury. Actually, only the only the six, only the six caps for Hugo Felix. Well, if we look at his career stats, guys, he's an absolute flawless machine. Nine goals and nine assists in ten appearances in the league this time around. So we've got um, India, India, and then Javor in the league. And then we got Champions League fixture against Manchester United. Can we fit that in today? Maybe. If I wanted older videos to do something with, what would I need to do? 
Tell me which ones you want to start with, CT, and I'm sure I can. Uh, I'm sure I can locate them for you. Hugo Felix is just from another world on FM. Yes, I tend to agree, agree Ruben. He's an absolute machine. Probably all of your Red Star videos. Fuck. Um, I don't know what the quality is once I download it, but let me download. Let me download one when am I, I'm in the office again tomorrow. So let me download one on Thursday, CT, and I'll see the quality of it. If the quality is decent enough, mate, you can have whatever you like. And I'll put, put it in Google Drive or something to that effect. Maybe I could download them in batches of five for you. I don't know. Just getting into FM. Love it and loving your content. Thank you, Nino. I really appreciate that. It's comments like that that really, really do sort of make your day, you know. And like today's video is is a stinker, really. Um, it's not football manager related, but like it's it's football related. So you'd like to think that there's uh, some crossover, but it's a 10 out of 10. And it's like way off the pace from a normal video for me. But is what it is. We move. We move. Predictions for the Spanish league. I think Real Madrid are going to win the league. I think Barca will give it, give it, uh, give it close. Thinking of making episodes for you in my free time that are one to ten. Well, CT, we could talk about that. If that is something that you'd be interested in doing, I would happily pay you for my for, for your time. Um, and obviously that goes into next year as well. So um, we'll have a chat about this on Discord, mate. Drop me a message and we'll have a chat once I get off stream. What team in La Liga is fun to do a rebuild? Valencia. I like Valencia. Valencia are always a good suggestion of mine. Looks like we're having a pen ref. I still need to get that on here, don't I? I need to figure out which button's going to go. I mean, I've got this button from the playoffs. No! That could probably go for a little pen ref. Kike scores. No, John, I keep forgetting to set it up. Um, hold on. Fancy Premier League. It will be, and I will at everybody. Let's sign in. One, two, zero, four. I'm pretty sure that's my login information. Okay, fine. I've ha oh god, I've had to reset my bloody email chat. This is a nightmare. Absolute stinky nightmare. I don't need the money. I just want to get more experience with DaVinci Resolve. Maybe I'll start with episodes 1 to 10 and see how long it takes before committing to the rest. 100% man. 100%. Cheers, Credo. No worries, man. Mrs. having a stinker. I hope uh, Mrs. C starts feeling a bit better, bro. Go and do your, uh, go and do your duties around the house. I appreciate you stopping in as always, mate. Right, Premier League. Change your password. Ah, it's got to have a bloody special character. That's why. Am I in? 
Oh my god. Right, I'm just going to reset it. Manage passwords. Remove. <laughs> Fantasy Prem, remove. Right, there we go. I've not been watching what's happening in this game, chat, so... Been trying to sign into Fancy Premier League. I'm so sure I've done a team. I have done a team. Right, cool. We're in. So I will set the league up as soon as I get off stream, fellas. Can't argue with that, CT. Kebab has got to food. Agree. I was thinking about doing Deportivo. Deportivo, very good. They're not in the... Did you not want... What did you say? They're not in La Liga. They are a very good team to rebuild, though. Oh, my gosh. Do a series with North Korea? Yeah, I did see you say that about North Korea. Uh, are they even in the game? Evening, Jace. How you doing, brother? Welcome, 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 as always. I swear, every time I look at this team doing poorly, Brueggemann's playing in it. Uh, leagues and cups. Uh, I just want create and join, create a league, create a league and cup. Options, invite friends, copy auto join link. Right, okay. I'm doing this. I'm doing two things at once. Uh, we are going fantasy football at everyone. Ping in left, right, and center. All right, there you go, everybody. Fantasy Premier League League is set up and is in the Discord. Please do go and join. Please and thank you. There will be a prize for whoever wins at the end of the season. Indonesia manager. I'm sure you can be the manager of international teams from all over. FM Lama does Indonesia. Nice. You've seen the recent announcement from Source out SI. I'll probably be doing it. What? The Fall Guys tournament? Is it a tournament? I did see that they posted something. Custom lobby with standard solo show. Ooh, nice, man. I haven't played Fall Guys for months. I have not played Fall Guys for months, so. Could be, could be something we have a look at. The goal 50. We don't have anybody. Luca Kana's in 12th. No Red Star players. Two nights of four guys. Winner from each night gets a copy of FM23. Fair play, man. Fair play. Uh, I think it's good what sort of SI do. They're really good guys. Uh, next match is in 13 days. Right. I should. This is what I should have done. Got to this point and then gone, now we go on holiday.
if you guys fancy joining the fantasy premier league please do come on in via the link that i have just posted there if you've already got a league uh if you've already got a team set up please do come in and join i need to also web what's that web i need to get the one from Falors, and i need to get let me get fantasy football is that it no tracy boone And then I need to join Draft. Draft. Right, there's the code. Good lord, this is this is long. I'm glad that uh I'm glad that we are all set up here. Team name expected to lose. We have no team. Uh no, yes, join. All right, we are in. Who the fuck is Stuart Morgan? Who the fuck is that guy? Who the fuck is that guy? I'm not even gonna bother trying and reset my password. Oh, uh, yeah, that's basically what I did. It needs a special character, if that's any help, CT. <laughs> it needs a special character. I'm in. Let's go, Martin. Love that. Uh, quick pick. Rotated. Full rotation. How is Bjorkovic in my full rotation? I don't understand. I'm in. Let's go, boys. Good to see you guys in. Uh, let's edit that message in the old Discord. At everyone. The league is all set up now. Join via the link below. Winner gets themselves a 50 quid Amazon voucher. Oh, we've conceded. Cheeky. Yeah, there is a 50 quid Amazon voucher on the line for Fantasy Premier League. If you guys fancy coming in. The Jamaica national team, the reggae boys. Uh, I know GYRFM's won a tournament with them. The Gold Cup, he won that with uh, with Jamaica, which is very interesting. Fair play to him. I'm not hugely fussed on international management, to be honest. It's, it's not for me. Um, yeah, so, yeah. North Korea, South Korea, don't care. Jamaica, don't care. England, Spain, Germany, don't care. The only reason I did Serbia in this save was to, like, grow the nation as well. Um, and then I got sacked. So, after getting them to a quarterfinals of a World Cup. I've just berated the team because they are playing dog shit. Now I'm going to press this button. 
pretty much what I've just said to them there. Get your act together, chat. I love there's an option for me to report offensive names. Is that not the whole point of uh, fantasy football? You wouldn't want to underperform as the career manager. Very true. Right, Ruiz Diaz. I didn't want to play Cockerman, but he's coming on. Right, we're changing this around to try and gun for some points at the very least. There's going to be a berate shout going in as well. 16 shots, 4 on target. Away at Javor. Is this going to be our first loss of the season? I think it is, chat. We're going to lose this game. I'm embarrassed by that performance. Absolutely shameful. Imagine if you won the World Cup with North Korea. That would be the sort of thing that would get picked up, though. Right. I've lost to, J to Javor before, haven't I? Yeah, they've beat me twice. And look at some of these other results, man. Fucking sickening. Cockerman, you're fine. You would play more games if you weren't exhausted all the bloody time. Right, chat. Final game of today's stream. Manchester United at Old Trafford in the Champions League. I'm going to pop it in the chat. We're going to do a poll. We're going to do a poll. Do we beat Manchester United? Question mark. Yes. No chance. I will ask my community community what do you think will we beat manchester united in the champions league away at old trafford we should have beaten them in the first game annoyingly drew 3-3 what's the best role for hugo felix i've tried him as a shadow striker and an advanced playmaker in that central attack in the field role and he has been brilliant in both so honestly um is what it is you know Bloody Bernardo. I can understand why he went to Ajax in the end. It's fine. Kana's excited ahead of Hood reunion. Return of the... Ah, that says the cock now. That says the cock. He'll score, but you can beat United. I hope so. Eight of you have voted and 100% of you are saying, yes, we can beat Manchester United, which would be sick. That would be very good. Come on, guys. There's 29 of you in here. At least have a little bit of interaction. Come on, chat. Have, have some votes. Do some votes. Right. We play Manchester United today. Raspadori injured. Will not play. 92% of you are now saying that we can beat Manchester United. I'm going to swap those around. We're going to swap you around. This guy is just tired 24-7. Might as well beat United, you know. Why not? I agree. Why not? Is Seager... Needs a rest. Well, I need a centre-back who's going to play a game. Because Zivkovic is not the right man for this role right now. I think I need a centre-back, but luckily we've already got one arriving in January, chat. Right, I'm going to end the poll there. 
85% of you saying yes, we can beat Manchester United. The only time I want United to lose? Yes, John, you know it makes sense. And Martin, it is the GYRFM Swanzalona V3 that we are using in this save now. I wonder if some of these South American players are making huge journeys for the qualifiers. Exactly, Jace, exactly. Quite possibly. I mean, Cuevas is Mexican, so that is potential. Good challenge, Hugo. Cisse, over the ball to Cockerman. Abdullah Cockerman! He's gone round the goalkeeper. He's finished it. But they flagged him for offside. No. We need the victory here. Shelley was always tired. Oh, very good point, you know. Very good point, him going over to play for, play for Peru. Good interception, Cuevas. Good ball. Good cross. Cockerman hits it straight at Henderson. Spencer! Henderson with the save again. Dean Henderson doing bits for Manchester United here. Hugo Felix on the set piece delivery. Awful. Swedberg easily getting that one. When playing Bolivian teams, you always tire quickly. Yeah, that's because of the altitude, though, isn't it? Fofana. That's an interesting signing to see at Manchester United. Nianzu as well. Not shitbag. Anyone but shitbag. Oh, I've submitted my squad. Now, how can I see it again? If you go on transfers or something, Hermes, you can see it that way. When's the next tactic video coming out? Thursday. Thursday. And all I'm going to say is... Why so serious? Speaking of less serious... Nice car. Abdullah Kokoman has put Red Star Belgrade... In the lead, away at Old Trafford. Good challenge by whoever, uh, James Justin, but it just falls into the path of Abdullah Cockerman. And the cock strikes first. No Luca Kana in this game just yet, chat. United playing it around the back nicely. Into Fafana. Interception. Felix. Oh. Oh. Costa Luca. Oh, <laughs> Let's go. That was liquid football. What happened to the player rebuild? Are they over? Uh, temporary hiatus, let's say, CT. Um, only because they weren't doing as well. Um... As previous, as other videos. I want to try a couple different things. Changing of the schedule. All of that stuff. The cock is strong. He is, he is he's a good looking cock. I'll give him that. Which means we go top of the league. Or top of the group, should I say. With a game against St. Gallen remaining. You haven't replied to my Twitter DM. When did you send me a Twitter DM? When did you send me a Twitter DM? Helmets 2K. Oh, you were in my um, in my message request that I'd not seen, so I can only apologize. Having trouble with the training schedules folder. I create one and put the files in, but when I went into the game, it's not there. Maybe there's something wrong with the files. I don't think there should be anything wrong with the files. Yeah, you went into my not immediate inbox, if that makes sense. 
Um, so I can only apologize, helmets. Um, but yeah, I'm not really sure what the problem with that could be. If other schedules have worked, then I'm not really sure. Um, I know other people have been using my training schedules. I believe Balin uses my training schedules, for instance. If you finish second in the group, you'll get PSG again, but, but I can't not see you topping the group. I mean, we've been ahead in some of these games before, you know. Kana. Poor pass from him. Oh, why do I talk? Zaniolo drags it wide. Woof. My do Nacional save to see Suarez dominate the Uruguayan league. Has he gone back to Uruguay? Have I missed that? Spencer having a poor game here, but Posta Luca's having a good game, so. We'll move the post over there. We'll bring on Kike because he's big lad. Because he's big lad. Uh, Pablo Torre, probably not the most physical. Brueggemann is prone to giving away a penalty in what I've seen so far, but we'll try him. Yeah, not had any issues with the training schedules. Yeah, helmets, we'll try and get it sorted, mate. We'll try and get it sorted for you. I don't see why there would be an issue. Gomez on the corner for United. And Luca Kana heads over the bar. <laughs> oh. Suarez has gone back. Nice. The club that he started his career at. Fair play to him for going back to you there. Hugo Felix is on one and a half stars and he's still good. Yes. Yes. Star ratings don't matter for anything. Ah. Emotional damage. It had to be him as well. It had to be, didn't it, chat? It had to be Mason Greenwood. We're going to draw this game, chat. I can I can easily see us drawing this game now. It's United at Old Trafford. He has to be offside. No ifs, ands, buts, or maybes. I do absolutes. And I am absolutely sure Marcus Rashford is offside. It's a lot tighter than I thought it was, chat. I'm going to hit them with a focus shout. Oh, it's going to be United at Old Trafford, isn't it? Good interception. Hold on to it, cock. Doesn't. Nianzu wins it in the air massively. Oh, sitter for Rashford. Is that going to be defensive shutout time? Maybe for us now. Two minutes of injury time. Bojan's going to score. I think he's offside as well. I think he's going to be offside as well. And it is. The goal is disallowed. As we go into the 94th minute. Of course we have a highlight. Rose edit, boys. Ah, oh, Brueggemann giving the ball away again. Oh, luckily Rashford couldn't hit water if he fell out of a boat. Right, game over, please. There is the 94th minute. Yes, please, ref. Yes, please, ref. Yes, come on, let's go. Fuck you, Manchester United. Even if shitbag scored... Unhealthy? Yeah, it definitely is, Helmets. It definitely is. Definitely is. What a, go what a result that is. Beating Manchester United at Old Trafford to be top of the Champions League group with a game against St. Gallen coming up. It looks like... It looks like we are about to top our Champions League group. And we play St. Gallen away, but 
I'd like to think, given what happened in the first game against St. Gallen, we will be able to go through and be pretty solid in that. In terms of the overview, though, Abdullah Kokoman is now on 17 goals in the Champions League. Uh, we are the only group that's not had any team qualify yet because we're going to play St. Gallen. Manchester United are going to have to play Porto. So Manchester United could potentially miss out. Luka Kana scored eight in the Champions League. That's cute. Galatasaray qualifying. Jeez, smashing that group. Lille go through in Q1. Right, as things stand, I can almost guarantee you that we will get the runner-up of this group. Real Madrid or Liverpool. We will, If we top the group, we'll get the runner-up of that group. I can almost guarantee it. There's not going to be any Celtic or Feyenoord or anything like that. We're going to get put against one of the big bastards. I can almost guarantee it. Um. Anyway, chat, that is something for next week. I've had a couple of wobbles tonight. We've had a couple of losses, but we move, we move, we move. Um, thank you very much, as always. I'll be back on Thursday evening for the network game with Murph FM. Please do stop by and check it out. But until then, guys, have a good rest of your week, and I'll see you Thursday evening. Nice car.